Hi, Isaiah here at Lancaster County Marine. Today I'm in our shop and I want to show you a custom Hobie install that we just did. Here we have a Hobie compass in the camo and this particular buyer um, wanted to add a Hobie Torquedo Evolve, the electric motor, to this kayak. So for us to do this, um, we made a, a couple changes. First off, we installed the rectangle hatch here in the center. You can kind of see how that looks there. Pretty sweet option to add there. The rectangle hatch is kind of a coveted hatch on any Hobie and can be added to most Hobie kayaks. Um, but the round hatch was located right here originally, so the round hatch, we don't want to waste that, of course. So we move the round hatch up front here. It does a couple things. It gives us storage, but also gives us the ability to reach inside and uh, handle bolting the Evolve and running cables internally inside the boat. So it really is a functional uh, feature right there. Um, we look at the center and the rectangle hatch there. You'll get to see where we place the battery in here. First off, nice thing about this hatch, we can still add the rectangle bucket into here or the tackle trays, we still have the room. But the wiring's nice and clean. You can see our wiring job. On this side, we have the wiring that runs out to the controller. And on the flip side here, we're gonna have the wiring that runs to the electric motor itself up front. So right here, we have the battery. This is a lithium style battery. It's very lightweight. This whole unit uh, for the Evolve electric motor controls, battery and everything, it's just under 18 pounds. So very lightweight and compact. You can keep it out of the way right there. What's awesome about this Torquedo, we'll just demonstrate a little bit right here. When we power it up right here, it's gonna tell me my battery percentage at the top here. We're at 98% of battery life. And I can go in forward, neutral and reverse on this. Just remember what this is all telling us. So at this percentage right here, at this speed, I can run this for 15 hours of runtime. Full power, if I was running it, it's right around six hours if you're at 100%. There you can see six is popping up right there. Wattage at the bottom, show me how much energy I'm using. And then the third line right here, it's still searching for, this is kind of through the GPS, but that will determine my speed. Give me accurate speed settings. So here you can see we want to go in reverse. You can go anywhere in between. It's, it's very sensitive throttle control. Um, nice thing about how this is all set up, the compass has these tracks on either side. So we just simply use a one inch track ball that we mount this to. And so we can loosen the ball, we can move this, we can go further away, wherever it makes sense to have easy control for your hand. We mounted this on the right side because you're steering handle is on the left side of the boat. So it just makes sense that as you're steering this boat and the rudder system, you can steer with the left hand and operate your throttle controls with the right hand. So nice option there. The Torquedo does have a simple kill switch right there as well. And if we look at how the wiring, this, this boat is extremely clean with how the wiring works and Torquedo, um, they have a really great system and stall system for their boats. So if we loosen the collar here, you can simply unplug the wiring. Everything has waterproof caps so we can keep the corrosion and moisture out of the terminals. And then the Torquedo installs and removes the same way that the Hobie Mirage Drive drops into the hole right there. So that's a pretty sweet feature. Very simple, we just reconnect it right there when we're ready to run it. So that's a quick look at a custom Hobie Compass that we just did here at Lancaster County Marine. If you're searching uh, for a quality Hobie dealer that can do custom installs, visit our store, Lancaster County Marine. Visit our website to learn more about our store, that's lcmboating.com, or call our store with any questions, 717-859-1121. Thanks for watching.